Is or was there a medical a health worker in quarantine or isolation as a result of his or her on-the-job interaction with a suspected or confirmed case of COVID-19? Okay, so our normal, and you would find this under the CDC regulations and the WHO regulations and recommendations in terms of protecting your healthcare workers. So if someone has seen a patient, depending on their level of exposure, so if somebody saw a patient and they had on an N95 mask, or if somebody saw a patient without having a, a mask on, different variations, once we determine that someone is a suspect, we immediately put those healthcare workers into quarantine until we have um, evidence of it being, yes, somebody who is, sus who is confirmed. And even, even at that point, even if we have somebody who, um, depending on when the test is taken, because you remember you can do a test at five days and you not register a positive result. But if your suspicion is strong, you might want to continue the quarantine for that person until you have another test. So our policy is that we need to protect our healthcare workers. Once we have a suspicion, while we await the testing from CAFA, we put those healthcare workers in quarantine, depending on their level of exposure, which would have to do with if somebody was fully in their PPE when they came into contact with someone, that person is thought of as not having um, as large, as great contact or exposure as somebody who say did not have on their mask. So is that a yes or a no? We have had at least how many persons we have tested? We have tested 101 persons. Some of those persons interacted directly with our healthcare professionals. And so, yes, those persons would have been protected. All right, thank you.